those days. What's up YouTube, it's Adam from I'm a Music Mogul and welcome to Tips and Tricks Thursday episode number 34. Today I want to show you a couple more tips sticking to the Ultra Beat theme. I want to show you a couple tips in Ultra Beat in which you can use. Quick tips, so uh, let's get straight into it. Basically I have a kit right here, Loaded Breaks Remix Kit. And I'm just going to go through some of the things that you can do in uh, Ultra Beat. Just a couple things right here that kind of helped me out when I first started with Ultra Beat. Basically, personally I don't like to draw in my... Uh, my beats like this through the grid like this. What I like to do is go to full view and sort of tap in my uh, drums like this as you would any step sequencer, any drum programmer. So if I hit play right here, I'm just gonna go ahead and put a loop right here. If I go ahead and hit play, I can bring in my, uh, I could draw in my, uh, my sounds and program my drums. So that's it right there. That's how you uh, go to uh, program your drums in Ultra Beat in the grid view. And this is what I like to use because uh, it's a lot easier to program your drums this way rather than this way right here. And then you can go back to here and change the velocity of, uh, say, my hi-hats. I don't want them to all sound the same. So I'm just going to go ahead and uh, change some of the velocities here. And you can go in and adjust it accordingly. And uh, let's say that was it. Go back to full view. And that's it right there. Basically, another thing I want to show you was that's really cool. I'm just going to switch this one right here. Let me just see what I'm going on. Let's switch my main kick to a, a reverse. So if this button right here will reverse your audio. So if I click it, that will reverse that sample. So now when I hit it, instead of this. So I'm going to click that to reverse. Now let's hear how it sounds. As you can see, that will help you on uh, some cool uh, effects. So let's do, let's reverse the crash. Just gonna go back to the kick, put it back to regular. As you can see, you can get a cool fact, a cool effect by uh, reversing your samples in Ultra Beat. And also one more thing that I want to show you. So let's say you like this pattern right here. So the quick way that you can bring it into your arrangement, if you want to have MIDI sections for every Ultra Beat kit that you create, just quickly drag here in this section right here, these dots right here beside pattern, click drag, click and drag it, and it will give you a MIDI uh, selection of that, sorry, a MIDI region of that, all those drums programmed right there. So if I open it up, those are my drums right there. Just be sure to turn off your Ultra Beat just so when you play it, you can play it live without doubling with these all these samples here. And then you can quickly arrange your drums like that from Ultra Beat because normally I don't like to uh, arrange my songs within Ultra Beat. I like to just drag the MIDI region in and then change as I may and uh, arrange it this way with MIDI regions itself because it's, it just makes it a lot easier. So that's it. That's a couple tips that you can use in Ultra Beat for uh, your future programming of your drums. I'm Adam from My Music Mogul, and I will see you on the next video. Remember, subscribe and rate for uh, more great videos, guys. Talk to you later. Later.